The 390 is the ideal tool to get started in photography and to support the first level of advanced equipment like interchangeable lens cameras and long zoom camcorders. A simple, fast and easy operation makes shooting photo and video a more enjoyable experience. To open the tripod legs, flip the locking levers, leaving all the sections extended completely. Once opened, you can adjust the height by releasing any leg extension by opening the relative lever. Leg angles can be adjusted in order to better level the tripod on uneven and irregular surfaces. Each leg can be set at two angles of spread. To change the angle on a leg, close the leg towards the centre column slightly and rotate the locking button at the top of the leg and then reposition the leg. In case you need extra height or a quick adjustment of your camera position, you can use the central column. To change the column position, flip the lever and adjust the height of the column as required. Close the lever to lock in position. In case of an accidental fall, a special anti-shock rubber ring prevents the disc directly hitting the tripod top casting. In case you need to shoot from ground level position, the central column can be inverted. Remove the rubber cap, flip the lever and remove the column pulling it upward out of the shoulder of the tripod. Invert the column and insert it in the shoulder from below. Close the lever and replace the rubber cap. The 390 photo kits include embedded ball heads designed for bridge, mirrorless and DSLR cameras with zoom lenses. The head safely connects your camera to the tripod, allowing you to control the movements and adjust the positions. Models with quick camera attachment. Remove the quick release plate from the head by opening the safety lever and the lever fully. Attach the plate to your camera by fastening a screw into the camera threaded hole. Ensure that the camera lens is aligned in the direction shown by the arrow marked Lens on the underside of the plate. Insert the camera plate on top of the head. Make sure that the plate is fully locked by pushing the lever. Models with disc attachment. While holding the camera with one hand, rotate the head top disc with the other hand until the screws securely lock the camera body to the head. Twist the knob to lock the disc. To adjust the camera position, release the locking knob while holding the camera with the other hand. Move the camera to the desired position and lock again by twisting the knob. The 390 photo movie kits include special three-way head for precise photo shooting and smooth videos. Large version. Remove the quick release plate from the head by opening the safety lever. If your camcorder doesn't have a hole for the pin, or if you're using a stills camera, you will need to remove the pin. Attach the plate to your camera by fastening the screw into the camera's threaded hole. Ensure that the camera lens is aligned in the direction shown by the arrow marked lens on the underside of the plate. Insert the camera plate on top of the head. Please ensure that the plate is fully locked by pushing the lever and checking that the camera is fitted securely to the head. The pan movement is controlled using the pan bar and it can be locked using the knob. The vertical tilt is controlled using the pan bar. Rotate the handle in an anti-clockwise direction to allow the head to be moved to the position required and then lock in position by rotating clockwise. The head also has a leveling movement that allows the vertical photographic shoot. Unscrew the knob to release the movement. Regular version. To remove plate, it is necessary to push the safety down completely and, at the same time, slide the plate. If your camcorder doesn't have a hole for the pin, or if you're using a stills camera, you will need to remove the pin
Fix the camera onto the plate by screwing a home camera screw into the camera's threaded hole without applying force. Before fully locking, align the camera lens with the pin if appropriate or with the lens marked on the camera plate. The pan and vertical tilt movements are controlled using the pan bar. Rotate the handle in an anti-clockwise direction to allow the head to be moved to the position required and then lock in position by rotating clockwise. The head also has a leveling movement that allows the vertical photographic shoot. Unscrew the knob to release the movement.